Okay, Bill, here we are. We landed at Hagerstown. So I thought I'd make a quick for you here, show you how I use the flight planner to, excuse me, use the GPS to plan the flight in real short order. So here we are at Hagerstown, pretty cool head on scenery airport. Pretty neat stuff here. over there. Oh boy, how about that? You can see my plane shaking a little bit. Okay, what we got? Oh, looky there, we're just sitting next to a cubby. Okay. Anyhow, let's plan our next flight. We're in Hagerstown. We're going to fly over to Martin State, which is right outside of Baltimore next to where I used to live. I used to live right next to Martin State. So let's bring up the GPS. We're going to use this button which is the direct to, it says direct to waypoint page. Direct to and we're going to enter Martin's airport code. Now once we use our wheel to get this Cursor moving there. Now I can use my keyboard. K M T N. Martin State. Enter. Enter again to kill the cursor. Now enter again to activate. Bang. There, it just made us a flight plan over to Martin. 65 nautical miles from where we're at. So now what we're going to do is hit the procedures button. Select approach, hit enter. We're going to take the ILS 33, hit enter. We're going to take vectors into that. Okay, hit enter. Load. So now we've got our GPS route over there. And we've got our ILS runway. And here's the approach to our runway. Now we could use this approach through the GPS or we can do it manually like I do just to get close, set ourselves, you know, or set a vector up over to the final and then uh, use the localizer to bring us in. Alright, so there's our flight plan. Now we can go here with all the information our airport destination. So you can see here's our approach for our ILS runway 33 which is a heading of 330 degrees. Here's our missed runway here for our hold pattern. Missed approach pattern. Here and get our frequency, which is 11070. So I'll go ahead and record everything. KMTN 33. Localize our frequencies 11070. And I'll go ahead and get the elevation is 22 feet. Now my flight plan's done. Okay, so we can zoom out and see our flight plan if we wanted. Go over here and see a north up version of the flight plan. Over here, North Maryland. Going over here to the eastern shore. We're close to the eastern shore, not the eastern shore, but or outside the ball. Alright. Back over to this page. Okay. Okay. That's how we use that GPS. Quite a powerful little instrument. So we're going to use the GPS for our autopilot. Switch this button here. Now 
nab GPS button to GPS. So now the nav button on our autopilot, our autopilot will follow our GPS flight path. This right here. Okay, bud. Thanks for watching. Good flight. There you are.